the peoples of Twitch, welcome back to another stream on the Meadow SMP! And today, today I am going to be initiating both myself and the admin properly and officially to the Meadow SMP because I feel like I probably should have done this a long, 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 long time ago, like when we first started the server, but no. No, I didn't. And now I have decided that today, today is the day that we're actually going to properly put together an initiation. Hello. Can I help you? Okay, well, we just got to be there. All right, then. All right, then. Well, well, today is the day we're going to be doing that. So I just pop this down because I did not clear out my inventory before stream like a smart person would. Okay, so now that's there. Yeah, that's not great. Actually, I, want, I actually want to bring the shulker box down and then just have an empty shulker box down there because I feel like that would be slightly helpful. Hey, what? What? What, what? A stream before 2 a.m.? Yeah, yeah. Usually, usually, the, usually today's stream is actually even earlier than this, but then I got to learn to drive. So now it is slightly later. I know, what? What? Bizarre. Bizarre. A stream before 2 a.m.? It's insane. It's insane. Yeah, yeah. My Saturday streams are usually a lot earlier in the day because I can. I can. It's great. Cars go brr. Cars are great. Cars are great. Cars are great. It even rained. And that, that was actually really annoying because then I had to drive in the rain. Oh, well. Oh, well. What can you do? What can you do other than be annoyed? Okay, let's not just head right on off and the admin isn't online right now So I'm gonna initiate myself all alone Because that that that's just something that I want to do I'll just initiate myself alone and then there could actually be a properly initiated member of the sir Hey, never mind admin is here. Great. 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 Okay, so we set up the everything for the initiation last stream so now I'm just gonna properly initiate myself. Great. Okay, so cool. Okay, I'm going to put all of my stuff inside of my house first because heaven forbid I don't look like I just joined the server. We we got we gotta simulate an actual joining of the server, which means I have got nothing upon me. Oh wow, that's weird. Oh wow, that's weird, that's weird, that's weird, that's weird, that's weird. This is weird, this is weird. And we're, we're just gonna ignore the 26 XP levels. Great. Admin. Admin. There, there's, there's, there's space in my chest down here if you want to dump your stuff in there. Sorry, let me rephrase that. If you want to get initiated, you dump your stuff in the chest inside of my house, if you would please. Oh, there we go. Admin's actually listening. I thought they were just standing there, like, lagging, and I'm like, what's up with that? And, no, no. Okay, fine. You know what? Fine. Fine. Fine, fine. Okay, admin. Admin. Wait, no, stop. You have a torch in your offhand. What are you doing? Okay, no. Okay, so first things first, I'm going to initiate myself, and then I will initiate you. Okay, so first things first, I need to grab the leather boots. And cool. Okay, now I actually need to head off to the original spawn point, which is a little bit far away, so I'm going to have to walk and hope that I don't fall into powdered snow. Because there's a lot of it over here. I mean, that that's literally where, like, half the deaths in the kill count came from. It is from this area here, and the amount of powdered snow that is around here. I also lost so much stuff into the powdered snow here. It's not even funny. Okay, okay, powdered snow goes all the way down here, so I think I'm gonna have to go above. Oh, dear, it is night. Actually, that, that's, kind of, that's kind of a cool time to get initiated. I mean, what initiation rituals don't go on in the middle of the night? Okay, so... Bruh. Bruh, that's powdered snow there. That was powdered snow there. Oh boy. Okay, here we are. This is approximately the spawning area. Great. Now I'm gonna put on the symbolic leather boots, and now I'm gonna walk across the powdered snow. The leather boots really don't have much symbolism other than the fact that it makes it easier to walk over the powdered snow. But I've decided that since we're, since anyone who joins is gonna have to wear them, this is this is initiation, and it's actually great too because it literally means that once you can't. You, yeah, once you get initiated, you literally have to immediately get initiated once you log on. Because otherwise, it is an absolute pain in the butt to get anywhere because of the powdered snow. No, 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 no. You wait until I initiate you. You go put those back. 
You go put those back. Put it back. Bad. No. You 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 need to wait. My initiation is special because I'm gonna be the first one initiated because gosh darn it. Gosh darn it. Technically, by name, I own the server. Okay, I'm actually going- I'm gonna pick the light blue and then I'm gonna dye my boots. There we go. And this is this is where the symbolism comes in. Yay, now I have light blue boots. Now I'm gonna read the gospel that I literally wrote, so not really gonna read it very much. Great. I agree. I'm gonna sign my- No. Okay. I need to turn on my caps locks. Why am I initiating myself if I don't ages ago? Because I decided that, gosh darn it, gosh darn it, I want to have an official initiation ceremony. So I make- because I want to properly do a really weird initiation ritual for the new joiner, but if I'm doing that, then I need to do that myself to all of us. So doing this first. Okay, great. See here. here. Great. Okay, there we go. Now I light the magical fire, and then just, yay. There we go! Anything to avoid blowing the hole in the roof? Yeah, that's also another reason. That's another, what's, the, what's the small problem? What's the small problem, admin? Okay, now I put this back, and now I can shift all this back, and haha. -ha. What's the small problem, admin? I'm slightly concerned. Come find you. Um, I don't have my elytra on, so I'm just gonna walk. Oh, I, I, I see- I see your- I see your nameplate. Or at least I saw it, now it's gone. Oh, there it is. That's a you problem, isn't I it? I stuck. <laughs> that is, that's a you problem, isn't it? Oh, there's monsters. Okay, lovely. I'm just gonna leave you with that. Have a nice life. I'm coming. I'm I'm coming back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm coming to help here. Ow! Why are you not why are you not critting, admin? Don't be a noob. Why do you have rockets on you? You're supposed to put your stuff inside of the chip. You know, it's fine. Admin admin's just gonna break the rules. Admin's just, just gonna break the rules. Wow. Ah! No! I can't, I can't have, no, I can't have not sacred. Oh, those are yours? These are, I am going to die. Okay, I am going, okay, this is great. This is great. Okay, so have your boots. Have your boots. I am going to go get food because I am dying. And then we can initiate you because there's still plenty of time left in the night. Oh, 1.19 exists. Yeah, it does exist. And we're planning on updating the server once we have all of the stuff. Uh, I forgot that I had a doghouse there. Once we have all of the mods updated. You should make a panorama of it. You should. Your panoramas are great. Okay. Let's boink this here and grab ourselves our carrots and just quickly eat it as fast as possible. And also sit in my regeneration because I love the regeneration. Okay, so now we have to take admin all the way. This is actually going to be slightly... This is going to be slightly harder now that there's monsters, but it'll be fine. It'll be fine. We got this. We got this. Okay, now admin has to go to original spawn point. Admin, do you know where the original spawn point is? You should go to it now and I'll meet you there. And then I can happily initiate you into the server. Ouch. Shaders are not- no shaders. No. Now what? I don't know where spawn is. Follow me then, peasant. Okay, now admin doesn't have boots, so we're gonna have to stick to not powdered snow path. Okay, this seems good. Oh, there we go. I can just follow the same path that I took earlier. Ah, uh, one of the beautiful things of having been playing one you point. Saw. I don't know what they. I don't know what that. I don't know what the end. Stole them from a zombie. Hey, no! Take them off. It's got to be symbolic. I don't know what my obsession with the symbolism is, but gosh darn it, gosh darn it, I'm gonna make it fancy. I'm going to make it fancy. Come on, Adam. Okay. Take- okay, you, okay, the boots are off. Great, um, put these on before the skeleton kills me. Okay. Wow, def definitely looks like you just joined the server, doesn't it? Okay, let's go! We walk. Oh boy, I'm a porcupine. 
Yeah, let's walk increasingly faster. Now, I'm thinking that next time I do the Jedi Stretcher, I'm going to do it in day because then we can walk slowly and not have to sprint and dodge monsters. Okay, now come on, Adam, along the mountain here. Come on, follow along, follow along. And then there we are. Okay, and okay, great, admin, come over here. Okay, okay. Now you need to light the fire first. Okay, there we go. Take the flint and steel. Light the fire with the magical flint and steel. Has to be the magical flint and steel. Light it. No! I'm going to burn to death, admin. If I burn to death, I am not going to be impressed. Oh, so this is this is so this was where the thing is. This is where this spawn was. Okay, well, I'm going back. Ha ha! Ha ha! The admin burned to death! The admin burned to death! Oh, they tried to burn the zombie alive. Okay, well, this ritual is going incredibly poorly. I think I'm gonna sleep and we can just- we can just initiate the admin. Ouch. 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 Okay, one second. I see that there is chat. I shall read it in approximately two seconds after I go sleep. Oh. R.I.P. Admin. This initiation ritual has become incredibly deadly. Okay, the cords. One second, let me grab the cords, but... Boink. Oh, you found the cords. Do you want the shaders or not? I... I don't really... Why can't I sleep? Oh, it's day. It's, it is day. It is day. Um, I don't really want shaders, no, and I like night the best. Night is cool because it is stars. I made this hard? Yeah, I made this hard. I made this incredibly hard. I made this incredibly hard. I made this initiation ritual incredibly hard by accident, but now it is day. Now it is day, and oh, and there was a creeper there. Oh, there was a creeper there. Okay, well, you know what? That's great. A clever- I don't know- I don't even know what a clever pick is. So... Don't know what's killing the admin or where the admin is, but I'm gonna go grab their stuff before it despawns. Night or midnight? Midnight is the best. Midnight is the best. Midnight is glorious. You literally- Oh. Oh. You literally- Named your elytra fly. I don't think I've ever been so disappointed in any one person my entire life, admin. Okay, I'm gonna put on some of the admin's armor so that I can go murder the creeper. Great. I did that? What do you mean I did that? I did what? I did- I have done many, many things. Oh, lovely. Okay, lovely. Well, I'm gonna have to fix that eventually, but not right now. Currently, we are trying to do initiation ritual if admin will get their butt over here. If admin will just- I- oh, I named- I named the- I don't think I named the elytra. I wouldn't just name it fly. Oh yeah, did they ever get the texture pack? Oh, I need to actually check that to see if it ever did actually properly go through. Last time I checked, it was still like, this does not exist. Haha, <laughs> schmuck. What does the admin have to eat? Why does the admin have no food? Why does the admin have no food? Why would the admin do that? That may be your stupid name. No, it's not. It's not. Because I, I, I choose incredibly intelligent names. I do not just name it FLY! All capital. All capitals. <sighs> okay. Well, I'm going to dump all of the admin stuff in here because gosh darn it, they're not supposed to have this anyway because... Uh oh, I need to actually sort this out properly. Uh, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Now I can place all this in and it won't sort up the admin stuff. There we go. Uh, the admin said sunning, I need to check it. Okay, uh, there we go. This is their symbolic boots. This is their armor. Da 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 da. Resource pack name. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, um, admin, are you here yet? Oh, there they are. Okay. No. No! No! Put your armor inside of the house. Yeah, there you go. Put the armor inside of the- <sighs> Admin. Admin! Okay, let's- let's just go do your initiation. Just leave the creeper be. Just leave the creeper be. Come on. Up the mountain. 
Up the mountain. Okay. I had to get here. Welcome. You're here now. Okay. Now that the admin is sufficiently angered. Oh, where's the flint and steel? Where's the flint and steel? I need to go get the flint and steel now. I left it down here. I must have left it down here. Okay, well, I'm gonna grab the flint and steel, then I'll be right back up. La da 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 da. Where's the creeper? I'm slightly concerned where the creeper is. Oh, the creeper's not here. You're good. You had it in your hand when you died. Yeah, I probably dumped it inside of the chest here with all the rest of your stuff. Yeah, here it is. You didn't have pork chops, did you? Yeah, I, I, I never found your pork chops. This is all the stuff I this is all the stuff that I found on the ground. I'll bring you some gold. I'll bring you like some golden carrots though. You you can you can have golden carrots. I'll I'll permit that in the initiation. Oh, you found them. Okay, never mind. I'll put these back then. Actually, I'm gonna keep them on me because then I can eat. I left them behind. Oops. Well, guess I'm blind. Wait, I knew that. Never mind. Okay, now we can pop up here and finally we can get on with the ritual. Sheesh. Sheesh. Okay, here we are. We are back up here. Great. Admin, here are your boots. Put them back on and we'll pretend that you just walked down from here. Get the pork chops out of your hand. Ex no, you can't sign it yet! You can't sign it yet! Put it back! Put it back! It's not that part of the ritual yet! How, 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 how dare you vandalize the name book? This is a precious... Okay, great. You have that. Take... The take the flint of courage and steal it. Fl take the flint of honor and steal a courage. Great, there you go. You lit it. Now give me back the flint and steel. Not in there. Just toss it to me. Not not the fire. Stop lighting me on fire. Great, thank you. Now take a die from the box and use the crafting table to dye your boots. Pick, pick a color. There's lots of colors to pick. Great. There you go. There you go. Now, now use the crafting- Only one! Only one! Only one! Thank you! And now dye your boots. Okay, and then put them back on. Once you- once you've colored them. Do you- do you know how to color boots, admin? Edwin, you you got you got you got to take the boots off, put them inside the crafting table with the dye. No, no, those are diamond boots. Those are not those are not dyed leather boots. I'm not an idiot. There you go. Okay, now you may pick up the book and sign your name by writing a two underneath my name. Yeah, write a two underneath my name and then sign your name. And then I sit here and cheer once you're done. Oh, wait. I forgot to have you read the book. One second. One second. One second. One second. Put it back. Put it back. Put it back. Adam. Put it back. We, um, I definitely, I definitely know how to do this initiation. Definitely. Put, put the book back, Adam. You didn't agree to the gospel of truth. I give up on you, admin. What is this? What is this? What have you done to the book? Okay, admin, I am going to read you the gospel of truth, and you must listen to it. Ready? You said put two under your name. No. Okay, admin, here we go. The gospel of thy server of Meadowness. Upon the joinings to the gathering of Meadowness, thou pledge to live according to thy rules and laws of non-jerkiness. Such include the following laws. Thou shalt not kill without a good reason. Thou shalt not steal without the approval of the person stolen from. Thou shalt not destroy other personages' belongings, only for if thou have permission. Any and all discrepancies in the behavior of an individual that results in a conflict of two or more personages shall be resolved in court. All personages shall adhere dutifully to the spirit of non-jerkiness, as decreed by Pukati. Do you agree to the gospel of truth? Do you agree to the gospel of truth? Sure. Great. Now, 
I shall write a two underneath my name, and then you shall write your name in front of said two in order to be initiated into the server. And then when done, just place the book on the lectern. Oh, in the UK, you say persons? Yeah, yeah, you, we're supposed to say persons, but I decided to be fancy, so I said personages. Okay. God damn it, admin. You said in front. <sighs> ah! In front when you're reading left to right, admin! I'm giving up. There we you go. You want it after the two? Just, no, no, I fixed it. I fixed it. Don't touch it. I fixed it. Now, welcome to the Meadow SMP, admin. I, I know that we've kind of been playing on it for six months, but now, now we're officially initiated. Yay! Cool, where's my stuff? It's, down, it's downstairs inside of my house. In the chest. The shulker box is mine. It has all my stuff in it. So your stuff is inside the chest. Great. And now... Now I'm going to put this out. And then we leave it for the next initiate. Which should be initiated sometime soon. As soon as there's a time where the time zones are good enough and they line up and they're all great. Yay! Now we have had the first proper initiation, because mine doesn't really count, because there wasn't a server member to initiate me. Great. But now we have the symbolic boots. Oh, and you, you need to keep those boots in a special place, because we all gonna wear our special colored boots whenever we initiate somebody new to the server. Okay, so just make sure you don't lose those. By the way, I love the purple. The it's purple? The admin's colorblind, for anyone who doesn't know. Yeah, your boots are purple. It looks great on you, though. It looks great. It looks great. Just remember to keep the boots. Keep the boots in a place where you will not forget them, because they are symbolic. And then if they ever get really brokenish, we're gonna have to fix them. Yeah. But no enchanting them, because that'll make it look weird, so I'll just fix it. Just... Keep the boots. Keep the boots. It'll be good. See, now now we actually have a proper ritual. It's great. It's great. It's great. Okay, I'm gonna take on my boots. And the, the boots are not for wearing recreationally, as for the fact that they will break very easily. They are leather. So. Okay, there we go! That's it, though! We were initiated! Yay! It only it only it only took. Oh, I need to put I need to put these back. I need to I need to put the flint I need to put the flint back. I need to put the flint of honor and steel of courage back. I really need to memorize that so that I can actually say the entire name every single time without any sort of hesitation or mistakes. This is this this is this is my new life goal. Oh, it's night now. Lovely. But yeah, let's pop back here and. Pop this back in here. Great. Awesome! Why are- Why am I missing three pairs of boots? I, th I think that the- uh, I think that the admin stole a pair of boots. Oh well. Oh well. There's a lot more dyes than boots anyway, so... I'm gonna have to add more boots eventually anyways. Just when we run out of time. Attempt three. Yeah, yeah, it was very interesting. You gave- I gave you many pairs? Bruh, I gave you one pair. You took extra- Oh, there's a very angry pig at me. There's a pig that's very, very angry at me. Hey, I have killed the pig that was very angry at me. I hear another pig that's very angry with me! There are a lot of pigs that are very angry with me. He killed you twice? Who killed you twice? And I actually don't- I realize now that I- uh, It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh dear, there's something very angry at me. Oh, so this is this tunnel. What's this tunnel? Oh, the admin built a tunnel to our portal. Oh, the pig. Yeah, yeah, these pigs are fun. They're chilling, you know? He's gonna break my shield. Okay, well, I'm fine. I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm alive. 
Wee! Okay, we are now back and awesome. Awesome. Boink. Okay, and now I'm gonna go in here and. Oh, I should sort this, but I do not want to! I will never sort that. I will never sort any of that. It's just gonna stay like that forever. It is just gonna stay like that forever, but okay, now that now that I'm done the now that I'm done the initiation ritual. Now that I'm done initiating me in the Okay, I need to actually put my boots. I need to go put my boots inside of a safe space. Okay, we got we're gonna go we're gonna go put our boots inside of a safe space and then we can head off to do more other things. Good grammar. Okay, um I believe I want to. I want to make a glow. I want to make a glow item frame to store my boots in because heaven forbid I just put it inside of a chest. I mean, what the heck? Just a regular ordinary chest? How how dare I? How dare I even consider it for a moment? Okay, and let's grab the magical glowing sack and craft it up. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. You can now write the word panorama at unthinkable speeds. That that is a ma that is always a good day. That is always a good day when you are able to item. Oh, just item print. Nice. How do I make it? Oh, you. Hey, let's get ourselves leather. Awesome. I have three leather. I really need to get myself more leather at some point because I'll make a lot. That'd make a nice clip. The good, the good day, the, the good day of being able to write panorama at incredibly fast speeds. Boink, there we go. And let's go put the boots inside of the item frame. Here we are. Great. Here we go. Where should I put it where it's not? Because this is, this is two, this is two. Okay, I'm actually going to put it here in the middle of my discs because I always have one inside of my jukebox. So I'm going to put my boots there because I like it. I want to put it there. Boink. What I said. No, no, what I said, and if I forgot, then I'll never know. Yeah, I, I just will never know. I guess that is, I guess that is life. Great. I will never know what I said. My, oh, my good grammar moment? That was a fun moment, I guess. Cool! Okay, so now I have my boots saved, and I'm gonna hope that the admin saved, saves their boots, because I have the feeling that they're not taking the initiation ritual too seriously. Nope. Okay, well... I have definitely forgotten what I have said then. Great. So now I'm now I'm minorly terrified. Slightly minorly terrified. Oh yeah. Also, I I broke my beautiful PG-13 this earlier. That was a glorious moment. Why would I say why would I say that? E uh, the beautiful the, the beauty of French keyboards. This 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 struggle that only French English bilingual people will know. We're just any other Latin language that uses the Latin accent and English or question marks or anything like that. You followed you followed my instructions. Okay, so you saved the boots somewhere where you'll remember them and be able to find them later. And you didn't enchant them. And you'll definitely remember where they are for next initiation. Yes. Yes, you will. You will. Cool. So you fall. You so you followed the instructions. That's great. Okay. Okay. Let's see. And let's float down here. All right then. Oh, right, I actually want to work on my trading hall for a bit. It's been a while. Ooh, I forgot about the cookies I had here. It's not working. What's not working? What's not working? The pan. The panorama. Well, I'm sure that's okay then. I guess you don't. You don't really need to make a crazy panorama. I'm. I'm chilling. I'm chilling just fine. Just doing this. I'm chilling just fine doing this. Your monitor is currently in grave danger. Is your classmate that likes to break monitors in the room or something? <laughs> I remember things sometimes. Okay, I'm gonna grab cobblestone in here as well as the bows and start crafting more dispensers because I need to get rid of the absolutely insane amount of everything that I have here. Memory comedy. Glorious memory comedy. Only only those who watched- was it yesterday's stream or the day before that? I cannot remember anymore, but a past stream. Only those who regularly watch the stream shall understand. Okay. 
And let's just craft a heckin' ton of dispensers. Feeling good. Well, ran out of bows. Awesome, that's actually a good thing for me because now I can trade with villagers to get even more bow, more bows without feeling ashamed. Well, at least only at least feeling slightly ashamed of myself. Okay, let's get more bows. You're literally using the same settings. Why? Why? I have no idea. I've never. I have never made a panorama, so I have no idea what's going on. I'm just. Oh, there we go. There we go. Well, time to go back to your calibration. You made one. Nice. Nice. Okay, glass panes, and let's go trade this with the cartographers. Cool. Cool. Okay, and now we pop up here and over here and go trade this with the guys over here. Because now I need even more glass. This is this is totally this is totally cheating, by the way. The fact that I can get infinite emeralds by starting with just like one or two. Okay, now we pop down here and we turn these into glass panes. And then we go trade with this guy again. And just continue doing this for a while. It's perfect. And now where I started with like six emeralds, I now have 14 emeralds. It's great. It's great. It works a lot better if you start with a lot of emeralds. Because then you can duplicate them even faster. But I started with like five. So I really did not do this the right way. But it's fine. It's fine. I, I don't need to do it the right way. I shall just do it however I please. I shall do it however I please. Thank you very much. Okay, now we pop this over here, and we pop this in here, and then we go, and oh, never mind, he sold out. There we go. And now I have multiple stacks of glass paint, which means that I can work even faster. I can work even faster now, and it makes me very, very happy. Okay. And that's what I'm going to do with these emeralds. I'm going to use them to level up even more villagers, because... Why have a really good trading hall when I can have a really amazing, super awesome, uber amazing trading hall? Plans. Plans. Okay, can can there please just be somebody who sells glass? There we go. Thank you. Thank you. And I'm going to wait until I have more emeralds in order to do that again. Because then I can just... Then I don't have like a halfway done villager. Okay. And now I trade with this guy, and... And I'm just keep going. And now we're at 31 emeralds! 33 emeralds! And now we go again! I am definitely at some point going to set up a whole bunch of librarians down there that aren't meant for books, but are literally just meant for the emeralds. Because it is a pain having to come up here and look through all of the villagers for which ones have glass. It is a pain. Okay. Yeah, no, that's, 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 that's all of them, I think. Have they, have they reset their glass trade? Have they reset their glass trade? That would be helpful. That would be incredibly helpful, because otherwise I have to go back to iron. What a pain. What a pain. Okay. Uh, nope, not you. You! Oh, no, never mind, they did not reset. Okay, so I've got 33 emeralds to work with. That's not going to be nearly enough. So let's get ourselves a heckin' ton of iron, and get ourselves a whole bunch of emeralds. Because emeralds are great. Emeralds are great. Okay, and now I can feel rich again, even though it's just barely over a stack, so it isn't really gonna do very much for me. Oh well. Oh well. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, next step is dump this off, and let's head on downstairs, get all of our Fletchers leveled up, and then once we have all the Fletchers leveled up, we can start on a new section of the trading hall where I am going to have armor smiths, tool smiths, and the like. Most likely, I'll do I'll do tool smiths first, so I can get my diamond hoe, and then later on, I'll add in new halls for armor smiths and weapon smiths. All right, then how are you doing? Let's get this guy leveled up real quick. Hey, look at that! I was actually almost completely leveled up. Nice. Are you going to level up? There you go. There. Oh, I need to buy the crossbows now. I don't like the crossbows. Okay, and I buy 11 of these, I believe is the exact number I need. And that'll give me a little bit of extra XP left over, but that is good because then I can do the feather trade and get exactly the amount of XP necessary to get them leveled up to their next level. Great, and yeah, there we go. There we go, I think it actually might be 10. It might be 10 crossbows now that I think of it. Hey, 
Hey, there we go. Now we have a jump boost error. That's great. That's great. That's great. I expected him not to be an elemental after all of that. Like, I expected him not to have any sort of potion arrow after all that effort I put in. It always seems like the villagers you put the most effort into decide that they're not going to be helpful. They're just not going to be helpful. Okay, I'm going to put the bows in here and then put the crossbows somewhere else. I really need to find a use for all these crossbows because I have no room for them. I have no room for them anywhere at this point. I am just going to- I'm going to have to build an entirely different storage warehouse for the insane amount of wares that I have here. And then I'll just have to turn my downstairs villager just junk storage area into some sort of, I don't know, secret apocalypse style bunker. Or with like filled with actual proper geared up stuff. Yeah, that, that's that's probably that's probably gonna be my plan actually. Cool, so now I have a new build plan. Um giant warehouse for a whole bunch of villager goods. Although for that for that, do I want to build an automatic sorter? Although I won't be able to automatically sort neither crossbows nor bows is a problem. Huh, that is a problem. That is a problem. Although can a lays do that? I think I might I think I actually might be able to do that with the lays. I'm pretty sure they can do something along those lines, can't they? I don't know. Okay, so it is ten. It is ten crossbows to get leveled up. So I was one over. Great, and then I just do the feather trade, and then one more crossbow trade gets okay, so I was right. It is it is five four. That's nine. That's nine. Where did I count wrong the first time? No idea. But it is nine crossbows to get them leveled up. Okay. Great. Great. Hey, there we go! Now we have power! This is going great! I'm on a roll! I am on a roll! What am I trying to sort? I am trying to sort bows and crossbows, but they don't stack, so you can't use the traditional item sorter. Like... And then I don't know what a lay- I don't know what a lays- what a lays do. I know that they have something to do with sorting, kind of. But I definitely have not been staying as on top of the Minecraft update as I usually do. Especially since I haven't really wanted to update the server because that would require like getting rid of stuff. So instead we're just gonna update, not make a new server. It's gonna be great. Okay, um, let's see. How are you doing? I should not just close him in while I'm trying to talk to him. That would not be helpful. Okay, I want nine of these. Exactly nine of these. And then that should give me enough XP to happily level up my next guy. Oh my goodness gracious. I have so many crossbows. You know what? Where is my wood? Where is my wood? I need wood. Actually, barrel barrels work too. Barrels work too. I'm going to chop out this layer here. And I'm going to turn this side specifically into a crossbow slash bow storage area. Because I have so many of them. This isn't even funny at this point. I just have so many of them. Okay, let's check over here and... How about here? Um, okay, now I just need to level up this guy using the feathers. And, well, I should definitely also build a, some sort of chicken murder system with my chicken farm. Because then I won't have to rely on the admin's chicken murder farm. I find it- Oh, no! I didn't get a special arrow from this guy. I'm sorry, sir, but, um... You're useless to me, and I'm afraid. Whoa! Where's my flint and steel? No! I was gonna have, like, a super amazing, super great speech where I just slowly burned him while I was watching him die, but I then I didn't have my flint and steel. Where's my flint and steel? Bruh! I just completely lost my flint and steel. This is a this has offended me. This has offended me to the absolute max levels. It just absolutely ruined my villain monologue. That just absolutely ruined my villain monologue. What the heck? What the heck? I realize that I am what the hecking my past self. I realize that, but we're not gonna talk about it. It's fine. It's there we go. I have a flint and steel. I have a flint and steel. Okay, now now I can go do my villain monologue. Okay, villain monologue time. Great. Sir. I put so much effort into you. I traded with you all the way. I supported you through your entire life, and now you betray me. You betray me, and I'm afraid that that is unacceptable. Goodbye, Jerome. Goodbye. Well, on that lovely note, on that lovely note, let's, let's just move along then, shall we? 
All right, then we got that guy. Okay, great. Now I'm gonna have to. I'm not gonna have to get a new guy, which is kind of annoying, but oh well. Oh well. Okay, let's go level up these guys and hope that they're not nearly as much of a disappointment as that guy was. Okay, so I think it's actually 11 bows that I need to get because I realize that I need to get a lot more bows and I need to get crossbows. So I'm thinking that my number where I had 11 memorized for some reason is my bows. Yeah, that's 8 plus 3 is 11. Cool, so it's actually 12. 12 bows, 12 bows to get leveled up. Let's go dump these bows off in here and then we can actually do a little more dispenser crafting once we get that barrel all filled up. How you doing, sir? Okay, crossbows. I need to get nine crossbows if I just dump this in here. Um, okay, thank you very much, but... No, give me. Okay, nine. And there we go. Perfect! And now we go dump these up. I just have so many crossbows. I just have so many of them. This is insane. This is insane. I just have so many. Nearly just broke your calibration world with a poor circuit. That... That is sad. That is- th th bra bra breaking the calibration world is a sad, sad moment. Okay. Now we gotta level up this guy using feathers, if we just go grab ourselves more feathers. And then after leveling up this guy, I think I'm actually gonna go make my chicken death machine. Because I do not have very many feathers left and the admins doesn't actually work that fast, so... I think I shall quite happily just go work on my chicken death machine. There we go. Awesome. Awesome, and I actually have to look at the admin's chicken death machine so I can make my own of it, so. We'll check that out in a second, though. Okay, let's go see what this guy has. A potion arrow. Hey, there we go. Now we have a poison arrow. That's actually really good because... Actually, that's kind of useless to me because whatever I shoot already has poison. But what level poison is this? Oh, that's poison too, and it's only for two seconds? Yeah, that's actually, that's actually, that's, that is super pathetic when compared to my just usual poison arrows. Because I have the B origin, any projectile that I throw gives anything it hits poison. Like, anything it does damage to. So, like, if I throw a snowball at the admin, it's not going to do much because it's not actually going to do damage. But if it registers as taking damage, I poison whatever I throw a projectile at. So, whenever I try to hatch eggs, it, it, it usually murders the chickens inside already. It's great. It's great. Okay, how does the admin's chicken murder machine work? Let's see. Okay, so... It dispenses, and then when they grow up, they burn to death. Looks good, looks good, looks great. I go check the resident over here so I can see what's going on. Okay, so... Great, so the hopper goes down into the dispenser. And then this hopper... Oh, this hopper so you can add eggs to it. Okay, that makes sense. Manually add them, seems legit. Okay, and then... Okay, so a comparator facing away from it goes into a repeater. I don't know what that I don't know what that repeater is for, but I'm hoping it doesn't do anything. Hoping it doesn't do anything. It, it might I'm gonna see if it actually gets powered. Let's just see if it gets powered. I forgot to check if it got powered. I just kinda watched everything else light up and then forgot to look at this one. Come on. Please lay an egg. Please lay an egg. Please lay an Okay, it does not get powered, so I do not think that it is important. I don't think it got powered, at least. Great! Now I know what to do. I will go build my chicken death machine and probably have to come back in about 30 seconds when I completely forgot again how to make it. Great. Okay, so I just need to grab my all of my redstone gear, which is non-existent. Oh, I have a hopper. That's helpful. Oh, and I should have grabbed a dispenser while I was over at my trading hall. Let's grab ourselves our dispenser. And I believe I have some redstone also stashed away there for making the dispensers. And then a comparator is the last thing I need, but I can make those pretty easy. If I have quartz, which I'm not sure I have, realizing now that I might not have that. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Okay. Okay. Yes, the repeater is important. Okay, so I'm gonna need two repeaters then. I'm gonna need two repeaters, one comparator, one dispenser, and three bits of redstone. So I'm gonna need three bits of redstone for starters. I need the dispenser. And I have the hopper, and then I need the two torches for the repeater, the three torches for the comparator, and the two torches for the other repeater. There we go. Now I just need a lot of sticks, which I believe I have a whole bunch laying around here somewhere. Meant for my villager train. There we go. There it is. And then also stone is important if I go make a repeater real quick. There we go. Um, A whole bunch of these, other than three. There we go, two redstone repeaters, and then a redstone comparator is what I need next, which I need quartz for. 
If I just go grab myself nether quartz. Oh, that stuff should work. Okay, good luck, good luck, good luck, good luck, good luck, good luck. Okay, and let's go pop over here. And voila. Okay, and then I should have a whole bunch of quartz over here. Great. Cool, and now I just pop into here. Oh, close the door, please. Thank you. And down we get. And then it should actually be all good to set up. It's, it's, it seems like a very, very easy... Oh, you know what I forgot to check? I forgot to check the delays. I forgot to check the delays. I knew I forgot something. I knew I was forgetting something. Where was all my nether quartz? Where's my nether quartz? I know that I have some nether quartz because I've gotten it before. Maybe it's in here? No? Okay, lovely. Lovely. Okay, so I might not have any nether quartz, which will require going out to shutter mine stuff. Ew, I don't want to mine stuff. Can can I please just find nether quartz here? Now, see, this is this is this is this is why I need to build a piglin trading hall. With because if I have a piglin trading hall, then I can just AFK the gold farm and get like so much of literally everything. There's literally so much of everything. Hey, there there is so much stuff in here. There is so much stuff here that I I could literally. I could- I could do anything with this mess up. I could build, like- I could literally build my idea of a bulk- a bulk villager junk warehouse. I could completely build it with just the stuff I have laying around inside of here, and it actually might even look decent. There's just so much stuff. I forgot what I'm looking for. I'm looking for nether quartz. I'm looking for nether quartz. No- YOU CALIBRATED TO THE WRONG SETTINGS?! NO! Oh, that's a tragedy. That is a tragedy. You can have, I can have some of yours. Um, I, I, as much as, as much as I love stealing from you, it it really ruins the feeling of stealing from you when you actively give me permission. I mean, bruh. Great. Okay, I'm gonna go down here and I'm gonna see if my nether quartz over here. So I have a feeling that I left my nether quartz over here so I can make more comparators for my flower farms here. No, no nether quartz. No nether quartz. Great. Great. I just love not having everything that I need to build whatever I need to build. Oh, there we go. I found some nether quartz, sir. This works. This works. It's his constitutional right as the Meadow Initiation Booklet of 2022 to not be stolen from without permission. You read that. Ah, oh, darn. 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 Great. Now, uh, now, now I actually do have to get permission from the admin to steal stuff. What a pain. What a tragedy. Oh. Oh well. Oh well. Let's just pop on up here. And, oh, there were a lot of turtles. There were a lot of turtles. I know that I say that literally every single time I look at that turtle pen, but I have a lot of turtles. Okay, let's fortune this down to the ground. Shame, sh yes, I, I am shame. I, I just, I just am shame. Oh, there we go. There, 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 there goes my biggest personality trait. Just stealing from the admin. Biggest personality trait, just down the drain. Fair, fair, farewell, farewell, the pookity stealing era. Farewell. Okay. Actually, I did not steal very much from the admin on the on the Bamboys SMP. That's a very new thing. And that's just because of the fact that I live so close to the admin that it's incredibly convenient to steal from the admin. Back in the Bamboys SMP, it was actually like a five-minute flight to go steal from the admin. It was a pain in the butt. Either that or like a four-minute walk of death through the nether. That 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 would that was also fun. So that was why I didn't steal from the admin on the Bamboys SMP. Other than like a few very ne ne necessary objects. However, I'm a politician. Break the law if I want. It just depends if anyone notices or cares. I am technically a politician. Technically. Oh my gosh, I am going to, oh my gosh. Next ne next next time I next time I need to win an argument, I'll just be like, I'm a politician. I can do whatever I want and they'll stare at me like I'm an absolute insane person and it'll be worth it. <gasps> no! I have made a mistake. I have made a mistake! Please go back! No, go back! 
in. Go back in. Go back. Actually, this actually might be better because I have a lot. I Yeah, I'm just going to actually get rid of all these chickens because I have an insane amount of eggs. I will just rehatch chickens once I am done recalibrating my chicken machine. Great. Okay, so great. Now it's time to just chop out this all and restart it. Great. New, new. How on earth did you get up there? I am so confused. How? I didn't know that chickens could climb ladders. This has absolutely demolished my brain. I have so many eggs laying around, and this is this is this is a problem. This is a problem. This is a problem. There are so many eggs! I have done this wrong! It worked, it worked! Minimal effort achieved! Let's go, let's go! Nice, nice. Okay, so first things first is I want to build the chicken destruction chamber. So I am going- actually, I want to add the collection area first. Okay, so I'm going to have the collection here, which means I need to grab that chest. It's going to be a pain in the butt to get. I just scroll through all the eggs. Oh, one day I'll get it. One day I'll get it, guys. One day in the future I'll get it. One day. One day. Just, 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 just a couple more scroll throughs, maybe. I'm actually going to face this way so that- oh, wait a minute. <gasps> I can just press Control q This has become so much easier. See, this is this is this is this is this is why you do stuff smart, guys, because smart is better. Okay, then I'm gonna put this hopper facing into here, and this will be the chicken death chamber. This is where the chicken shall die. You might try discording this one. Oh, that 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 actually would be really bit smart. That'd be smart. Oh, oh, it's two times the Discord max file size. Oh, cries, cries. Okay, um. Next up is I need a dispenser that's going to fire the chickens into their death slot, which is going to be here. There we go. If I just, I'm just going to put this here for now. There we go. Ah! Ah! This is an incredible pain in the butt when there's so many eggs. This is an absolutely incredible pain in the butt. Like, this is difficult. This is different. I am not enjoying this, and I've thrown my dispenser. <sighs> there we go. I got the dispenser again. Perfect. I'm gonna put it here. There we go. Chicken death chamber achieved. Chicken death chamber achieved. Great. And now I'm gonna put glass here so they can witness the chickens getting murdered. Put this here so that I can access my chest. Yep. Face this. I put the stairs the wrong way. Okay. Going to get the stairs. I threw the stairs. <sighs> there are a lot of eggs. There are a lot- of I threw the stairs again. You know what? I'm gonna put the eggs in here. I'm gonna put the eggs in here now. Because now I actually have a slime out of room. I threw them. I threw them anyways. This is- this is- this is horrible. This is not going according to plan in the slightest. This is not going according to plan in the very sli- There is not a single part of this that is not work- that is working. Don't click the ads on there. They have your classic green download button. Yeah. Yeah. They th Those are fun. Those those are real fun. Those are real fun. Great! Okay, I got that all worked out now. That's perfect. Let's dump more of these in here so I don't need to deal with them. Great. And awesome. Dealt with. I need to move this chest to here because... I would very much appreciate being able to have proper storage. Great. <sighs> Slowly working through all the- I just threw the chest. I just threw the chest and now I am ashamed of myself. This is the most difficult build I have done so far! Why is the bloody chicken machine the hardest thing I have done so far? It is a chicken death machine. It should not be that hard to build. I'll use an ad blocker. They'll be okay. <laughs> nice. <laughs> they are uploaded. I will check that out as soon as I finish this stream, which might go on forever if I try to finish this. There we go. 
Great, now I can fill in the massive amounts of eggs here and take that back because I need, I need, I need that. I need that. Oh, <gasps> that is amazing. I can just shift click and finish. Okay, um, this is the problem. Please just let me get my repeater out of there. I need the repeater. Thank you very much. I need the repeater. I need the repeater. I need the repeater. I need the... Ah! That was a lot easier. Hey. Now I'm just gonna top this up once the hopper starts dra once the hopper is done draining. Just shift click it in. There we go. There we go. And great, great. Now I just need to complete the chicken machine part of this. Okay, there we go. Hopper. I want to have twice the amount of chickens that the I actually can't have the twice amount of chickens because I don't know how to I don't know how the redstone works. Actually, I think I I, I know I know how the redstone works. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. I, don't, I know how the redstone works. I know how the redstone works. Sort of. Then we're gonna put glass there. And then I'm gonna fill in this area here. I'm gonna put this here. And then this can actually just be... This, this, can, this can become a stone stair if I can find the other stone stair. I think I only had one stone stair. Great. Great. Okay. Okay. Lovely. Lovely. Okay, I'm gonna put the stone here because I don't need I don't need anything else there. Great. Okay, so chicken death machine there. Chickens are going to grow up in there and then burn to death in the lava. Which I will work out later. I will work that out later. That is a later problem. Oh goodness, this is a pain. There we go. There is still a chicken up there and I'm just kind of leaving it. I can feed two sets of adult chickens to a single death machine. Great. Okay, so then over here it's actually time for the redstone part of this. The scary part. And I'm going to put the comparator coming out of it. I'm gonna put the comparator. Oh, oh, I think I need to raise this. Yeah, I'm gonna raise this because I think I actually need to have the redstone there. Great. Okay, great. Yeah. Yeah, I need to actually have the comparator. Okay, so great. Chickens are going into there. And I will have two sets of adult chickens going in there. Actually, I could definitely have, I could definitely have three. I could definitely have as many as I want here. I could technically have as many as I want, couldn't I? Couldn't I? I could. I will. I will. I will have this many chickens and nobody can stop me. Nobody can stop me! You used to have a super cooker. That sounds like something that my vegetarian self would hate, but I don't actually really care. Honestly, I would love to be able to eat meat. Alas, 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 my origin prevents it. Heaven forbid my heaven, heaven forbid I eat meat. Heaven forbid. Okay, now I'm going to load the eggs into here so that I can finally be rid of them. Oh, there's even more over here! There are so many eggs! Needed to do something with all the chickens I spawned all over the village. Oh, yes! That was, that was an incredibly fun prank. I love that prank. Okay, so now I need to put a comparator coming out this side. Oh, technically I don't have it on this side, but that's where that's where my cook that's where my cooker is. So I'm gonna put it going on this side. And I where did my redstone dust go? I know I I know I had redstone dust. Where'd the redstone dust go? I had more of it. I had more of it. Okay, well I lost it. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go get more redstone dust. I'm gonna go get more redstone dust, and while I'm getting more redstone dust, I'm going to go look at the thing again. I'm gonna go look at the admin stuff again, because I have no, no idea what I'm doing currently. I've completely forgotten what I had inside of my brain while I was trying to deal with the massive amount of eggs that I have. Okay, so the chicken incinerator is over here. And the way that it works is, if I can just get over here real quick, there we go. Okay, so the the hopper there is useless. Okay, so on the on one side of the dispenser, a repeater goes into it, parallel, or like perpendicular to it, a comparator goes out, feeds into the. Okay, there we go. So it senses it, and you said that the repeater is is needed. Okay, so both the repeaters have no ticks, so I need to have that there. And then probably a solid block there. Yeah, that fires. I was wrong. That does fire. That does fire. I was just too blind to see it. Okay, and then checking over here. Great. Looks like that block doesn't do anything special. So it's really just making sure that that block is there. Great. 
And then which way does it face? Does it face away from? I'd be sure it faces away from the comparator. Otherwise, it wouldn't make sense. There, it faces away. Faces to, there we go. Okay, so kind of like this. Perfect. I know what I'm doing now. I know what I'm doing now. It's a clock. Thank you. Thank, thank you, admin. I have no idea what that means. Thank you. Okay. Um, where is my redstone? Where is my redstone? One day, one day I will be good at redstone. One day I will be good at redstone. I will just struggle with it so much that one day, one day I shall have learned. One day in the far, far, far future, you shall see me being ultimate, ultimate redstone pog champ. It'll be glorious. It'll be glorious. Oh, you put them in the, in the art channel? Oh, that's perfect. I will make sure to look at that. I will make sure to look at that. It'll be glorious. As long as there's something in the dispenser, it will tick. Cool. Okay. Oh, there's an oh, there's a chicken here. Die. I also need to murder this chicken here without letting out Bill. There we go. Feeling good. And see, this is why I do not use swords because that sword would have just absolutely murdered the boat. A sword would have murdered the boat, but now I'm fine. Okay, so here this is. Okay. Is this, this can go this way. Okay, no, it's actually if I see the other way. There we go. It faces this way. So the inside is meant to tick. Great. And then the repeater goes into it. And the redstone goes this way because there's three of it. And there's a block that goes here. And... Why did, why did that only do one? Why... Why did that only do one? Why did that only do one? Ah! <sighs> okay. Maybe I need to take it more. Oh, maybe, maybe, oh wait, I probably just need to get rid of this. There we go! Crud, crud, crud. I need to seal this. I need to seal this all up. I need to get out of here. I, I need to escape. I don't- I don't know what I'm doing. I do not know what I'm- how am I supposed to do this? Okay, well, I have started the redstone clock, so that is just going to go forever now. Oh, yeah, 18 launcher. That- admin uses that to play Minecraft. Because the Minecraft launcher just isn't good enough for them. I- did I seal this? Yeah, this is sealed. This is fine. I'm gonna murder this child. I have murdered the child, and I'm feeling good about it. Okay, great. I'm gonna seal that off, and then I'm gonna put the glass back here. There we go, and perfect. Cool! Okay, now I just need to add in chickens at the top there. Oh. Hi. Hi. Okay, I'm gonna kill this guy. Okay, he's gone. Okay, great. I need to actually... I need to actually steal some of the eggs from here so I can... Actually, no, I have plenty of eggs. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Okay, let me seal this back up, and then do something with this here. Okay, um, I'm gonna seal it from the opposite way. So if I go through here and place this here, then I can put this here. There we go. Ah! I made a mistake. I have made another mistake. This is not working. This is not working. Okay, um... Where did- where, where did my dispenser go? Where did my dispenser go? Oh, there's my hopper. Oh, there's my stairs. Okay, there we go. I found everything that I was looking for. Um, put this hopper back. Thank you very much! Please put it back. And then put all these back in here, and then these eggs will continue to fire. <gasps> oh no, now they're just entity cramming. That- that's actually useless to me. That's gonna give me nothing other than just eliminate the eggs. Which admittedly is still a good- still a good thing. I mean, I have way- way, way, way too many eggs. But I probably should not do that. I probably should not just waste that like that. There we go. Okay, and that's still full of eggs. Great. Okay, next step is I need to go get adults- I need to get adults in here. So I'm going to go up here, all the way up here, build myself up to the top here. Still making a staircase though so I can actually get up and down. That would be helpful. Put this back down here so I can actually see. Thank you. 
And up we get all the way up to the tip top. And one more up so that the, the, the chickens really can't get out while I'm trying to spawn them. Perfect. They cannot get out like this. Awesome. Great. Now I am just going to throw eggs into here. Don't mind me, just spawning a whole bunch of chickens. Just leaving. Okay, great. Um and just gonna la 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 There we go. Okay, um oh, there is a child here. Do not appreciate the child down here. <gasps> I have made a mistake. I put all the baby chickens in there before I set up the killing machine. Which I realize they'll, they'll still die there when they grow up. They'll start entity cramming, but I need to do the lava machine first. Slab, slab. I needed to have a slab in there first. Oh, this is this is why you're supposed to look at the entire. Yeah, I'm crying. I am crying. I'm going to have to actually. I can I can actually burn them so that that won't be too 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 bad. That won't be too 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 bad. At least they won't explode everywhere if I just burn them where they are. So I'm gonna go grab a slab and then a bucket of lava. I can get a bucket of lava from here. Let's get that first because I don't have to search for that. That's easy to find. There we go, and then I know where I can find a slab downstairs. And I have a flint and steel, so I can do this. Or actually, I can just burn them with the lava. That works, too. That works, too. Okay, where is the slab? It should be in here. Um, let's use stone. Let's use stone, because then everything can be nice and uniform. Great. I find it hilarious that I have chicken, a chicken family there that I keep as my pets. Just a couple, skip, just a hop, skip, and a jump away from my chicken grinder that I'm currently trying to build. Okay, how do I get in here without allowing the chickens to just rampage? Not like that! The answer was not like that. However, they are all incinerated now, other than like four of them that escaped. Although, I think that they're all actually just gonna walk right into here anyways, so yeah, just be gone, children. Actually, be gone. Just be gone. Thank you very much, actually. That was very, very helpful. Other than you, I'm gonna murder you because you're in the way. Great. Okay, hey, and now I add the slab here. Will that will that still work? I need to try this out. If I put eggs in here. If I put eggs in here, will this still work? Okay, I'm gonna put this here for now and actually I'm gonna take this out, put this here, and then I'm gonna add this here. Okay, now I need to look here. How's that doing? How's that doing? Uh, can I get down here so I can see what's going on? Oh yeah, that actually works out great. That works out great for me still. That still works, which is good. That still works, which is good. Um, over here, I need to have lava in this block here. So I'm gonna knock out this, not that block. Okay, so I'm not able to have, not able to have chickens there. I just, there we go. Can't have chickens there, but okay, there we go. You go on up there. Thank you very much. Both of you actually just can head right down into there if I just. There you go. Never mind. It's gone. They're both gone. Murder and murder! I love murder. Okay, great. And then I pop this here, close that off, and over here, I'm gonna place this with glass so I can see this because it's always satisfying to watch chickens die. And then over here, I need to put the lava in this block here. Which I realize now is that actually means I can still have chickens here. And still have chickens here. Need to get that glass back though. Thank you very much. So I can seal these guys back in here. There we go. Great! Great! That actually works out perfectly for me. That works out great. That just means I need to get one more block of glass. And then I should be all good to just spawn in a whole bunch of chickens into that top area. And I should be able to just let it go. Just let it go and... Spawn stuff, and then murder stuff, and then spawn stuff, and murder stuff. Seems great. Seems great. Seems great. Seems great. Seems, 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 seems legit. Seems legit. Okay, uh, let's see. I need the piece of glass, which I believe I can find in here somewhere. Ah, there we go. I do have a piece of glass. Very, very happy that I have a piece of glass. Great. And then I'll just pop down here, see how it's doing. 
And I believe I still have my staircase up. Don't think I sealed it. There we go. And perfect. Great. Now I just hop on up here and... Oh boy, there are a lot of chickens up here. Why are there so much chickens up here? Why do they keep just appearing? Why do they keep just appearing out of nowhere? I'm very, very confused why chickens keep appearing out of nowhere. And can you actually please just get in? Actually, I'm just gonna murder these guys. They're in the way. They're in the way and I have so many eggs that it's not even worth it to try to conserve them. Okay, and now I'm just gonna start throwing in baby chickens until they start mob cramming or I get bored. Probably the latter because it takes a lot of entities to mob cram. So we're just gonna toss them in. I'm just gonna eat them in. It seems fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. There we go. And just be gone. Be gone, children. Well, hi, hi, child. You were not supposed to end up here. Just get in there. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay, bye. That 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 chicken surely lasted quite some time. I'm kind of worried about the fact that when they're older, they're going to start mob cramming a lot more than they did when they were children. I do believe. I'm sure it'll be fine, though. Hey, okay, that that child is gone. That child is gone. And if the child is gone, then I can murder it without remorse. Feeling good. Okay, awesome. And now we throw in even more eggs because more children is glorious because it means more adults, which in turn means more children, which in turn means more feathers. Oh, that got dark very, very fast. Great, great. Feeling good. Okay, how many children do I have in there? That is lots and lots and lots of children. However, they're not entity cramming yet, and I still have more eggs, so I'm gonna keep tossing these in. Just gonna keep tossing them in. There we go. And... I, I would be concerned about the fact that I poison the chickens, other than the fact that it's poison, so it won't actually kill them. So I should be all good. I should be all good. I should not have my flint and steel inside of my hopper while I'm eating this, because if I accidentally eat it, then I will destroy absolutely everything, because then the dispenser will have it and it'll fire, but since it's a dispenser, it'll just light a fire and it will not be fun. It will not be good, nor fun, nor happy, nor nothing like that. Hey, there are so many chickens down there. If they grow up, I think that they are going to start entity cramming, but I want to be 100% sure of that. Because I want so many chickens, it's not even funny. Like, I I want this to be the type of thing that if I accidentally ever break a block, it will be tears for hours. Because there will be so many chickens running around everywhere that I will have to abandon my house and live somewhere else. That is how many chickens I want in this hole. I even have three spots. So this is gonna be- this is gonna be three times as many chickens as the admin's chicken incinerator. It's going to be glorious, and that chicken is dead. It's gonna be amazing, it's gonna be amazing. And then I'll have so many feathers, and I don't know what I'm gonna do with all the cooked chicken, because I can't eat the cooked chicken. I am a vegetarian, thanks to my origin, so I will just sacrifice it to the blood gods, I guess. I'll just sacrifice the chi I'll just sacrifice all the cooked chicken to the blood gods. Seems legit. Where, with three spots, I am going to entity cram the baby chickens. <sighs> that is a very depressing knowledge. That is very, very depressing knowledge. Okay, well, I have a plan that I can at least conserve some of the chickens. Okay, so I'm going to knock out that block and add in water, which is going to push the chickens down there so then I can then block it off. Okay, so this block I think it is? <gasps> no, 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 oh. Murder and murder. Thank you. Great, okay, let's scoot back here a bit and put the water here. So when I break that block, it's gonna push them. Okay, be gone, please. Please. And then I can put this here. Eventually. 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 No, they're just- they're just staying. They're just staying. They're just staying. Okay, great. Um, maybe I need to murder some of them. Yeah, maybe I need to murder some of them. Okay, I'm gonna murder some of them. Okay, I'm gonna put this in my offhand so I can keep trying to right-click as I put this in here. Oh, I actually have this here. Wait and see. Wait and see what? 
Wait and see what? This actually might be easier if I just murder them all. I realize now. This might be easier if I just murder them all and then restart. Yeah, this might- this is gonna be easier if I just murder them all and restart. I might not have it overloaded. Okay, well, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's- let's wait and see, like the admin said, and if I don't end up having it overloaded, then I shall be incredibly happy. But that is plenty of chickens, and that is probably actually gonna entity cram when they get older, so I'm going to leave that be and be happy. Great! So now, I really can't see if this is gonna overload until all these guys are grown up and start laying eggs all the time. Oh boy, I left a gap there. I left a gap there. Up we get. Back up we get. Oh, definitely not that block. Is this part of the ritual? Oh, we finished the ritual a while back, and then I completely forgot to change the stream title. So, yeah, it's great. It's great. I already initiated both myself and the admin to the server, even though it's been like six months since we actually started playing. We don't talk about that. We don't talk about that fact. There we go. Hello, thank you. Thank you. Stream titles are overrated. Exactly, exactly. Stream titles are overrated. Stream titles are just overrated. Can I just get out of here? Thank you! Okay, there we go. There we go. Chicken incinerator complete. And just gonna hope that that doesn't overload and end up entity cramming that stuff. And now what to do with these eggs? No clue. Wait, actually... Actually! I forgot that that was a stair and now I'm gonna have to put that back. You know what? That that's that that stair is just not going. That this stair is just not gonna go back. It'll it'll go in this way. This is how this stair exists now. This is just how it is now. <laughs> and you initiated me on the importance of clear instructions. Wow, thanks, admin. Um, I appreciate you too. Appreciate you you too. You'll be lurking. Well, thank you. Thank you for lurking. Hope, hope that not 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 sure what to say when telling someone to hope for something while lurking so i'm just going to pretend that i have said nothing uh oh why isn't it working admin why isn't it working admin why isn't the clock working why did the clock stop working there we go it just apparently needs to have a little bit of space cool cool great I'm actually gonna put this- I'm gonna put it tilted to the side so I can still access the dispenser. There we go, now I can pretend- there we go, I can access the dispenser just barely. Just barely I can access the dispenser. Although I'm gonna put it on the opposite side so it looks cooler. There we go. There we go. And then... no, I'll be fine, I'll be fine, I'll be fine. There we go, and then if I just click on that, has it done with it? Is it done with all of them yet? Uh, probably. I'm gonna add more, that means. I'm gonna add more, that means. And just pop a bunch in. There we go. There we go. And then one more stack. Or I need the observer feeding directly into a repeater. How about no? How about no? My my redstone understanding is already maxed at this redstone here, admin. So thank you very much, but I shall leave it as it is. I am so happy though, this- this chicken incinerator is going incredibly well for me. It is going incredibly well, and as soon as those guys- Because all these are, are guys being hatched at about the same time, so as soon as they start growing up, it's just going to be instant death. Just absolute instant death. It's gonna be amazing. Okay, I might just go through here, uh, there we go. There we go. Eh, it's still firing, it's fine, it's fine. Just can't absolutely max it out. And I'll put some war in. Cool, okay. Okay. Oh, well, there they go. They're gonna start entity cramming now. That's lovely, I think. Oh, they're just growing up. Are they growing up? I can't tell if they're growing up or not. Yeah, no, I think they're just entity cramming. So let's pull these out. Let's pull these out and put them in later. Because as much as I really don't care about the insane amount of eggs I have, it would be nice to just not be blatantly wasteful while knowing about it. Okay. Awesome! That is dope. I think the next thing I want is I need to grab another another stone stair so I can make an easy access point to the dispenser. And then I can be done, actually, if I just drop all this stuff upstairs, if I can find an empty chest, which I don't think actually exists anymore within my house. But I'm sure, I'm sure we'll be able to stuff stuff into random slots until we're out of stuff. 
You think that black was raw chicken from up top getting burnt? What? What? Why? I I don't understand. I I don't under. Do you mean like maybe my chickens up above grew up and now they're entity cramming too? Maybe. Maybe. Okay, I'm gonna put sticks in here and a hopper in there, and now I can be happy. Okay, time to go grab. Time to grab that other stair, and then I can be happy. If the chickens up top entity cram, they will feed raw chicken into the dropper. Oh yeah, that's smart. That's smart. Yeah, and I hatched them all as babies, and there was an insane amount of them. So my guess is that some of them are going to entity cram. However, it it, it it's worth it. It's it's worth it. I have so so many. I'm gonna have so so many chickens. I'm gonna have the absolute max amount of adult chicken inside of there. It's gonna be glorious. It's gonna be glorious. Okay. And then if we just pop along here, we can add in the extra stone stair. Just sneak through here. And voila. And that actually does not help me with accessing. I need to completely change that. Um, like this. There we go. Now I can barely access it. There we go. I got it. And none of them are age- none of them are grown up yet, though, so- Or if any of the grown up ones age up. If any, if any of them age, grow up, then they're all gonna die, so- hmm. The adult ones are gonna end up dying, so oh well. Oh well. Okay, can I not get caught in the cobweb? Thank you very much. Great! So now that I have Chicken Incinerator 2000 complete- Oh my god, I just checked the time and I- I kinda wanted to start something new, but then I just realized that- <laughs> We're actually almost- we're actually almost done this stream. So, I guess maybe just something really, really quick that I can do? <gasps> oh, I know what I have not done yet. I did not deal with the soul lanterns. I actually need to tidy up that area. I need to tidy up the build still. So, let's just hop in here and check around for the lanterns. Actually, the lanterns actually work kind of well in these spots. Okay, so that one in that corner and that one over here. Awesome. Blow up another roof. How about no? How about no? No, I just don't wanna. I just don't wanna. And Bill is very, very angry at me now. So I have just angered Bill, but I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. Okay, let's see. I need to grab a stone block. A singular stone block so I can make the two sides symmetrical, because otherwise it shall bug me for the rest of my life. And if I'm gonna have an extra little ledge, then I'm going to need a flower pot, because heaven forbid I have a ledge that does not have something on it. And a flower pot is an incredibly easy little something to add to any ledge. It's great. It's great. It's great. It's great. Okay, and now a flower to add to the little flower pot is going to be a pink. No, it's going to be a white tulip because it's chickens. Ha ha! Symbolism. I'm not sure if that counts as symbolism or just placing a white tulip. Probably just placing a white tulip. I'm putting a lot more thought into it than I should. Okay. Flower pot, white tulip. There we go! Lantern, white tulip, lantern, glass, chicken! I'm gonna put an item frame here and put a chicken in it because I feel like it. <gasps> no! I just had an evil idea. What if I put William in there? What if I put William in there? <laughs> what if I put William in there? No, no, I won't. I won't. I won't! One, because of the fact that I, I really won't be using the chicken from that, from that farm anyway, since I don't really need the chicken. Really, I can't even eat the chicken. So really all I can do is feed it to my dogs, which I, I, I already have so many dogs, I don't need to feed them anymore since I don't take them anywhere so they don't get hurt. But we are going to grab the item frame and feathers. Oh my gosh, I have a lot of feathers in here. I did not realize how many feathers I had in here until like now, even though I've looked inside that chest like four times today. So I literally just built an entire chicken incinerator so that I could have feathers like a trade with my villagers without realizing that I have an insane amount of feathers stocked up. Yeah, now I have a feather now I have a feather machine. It's it's gonna be glorious. It's gonna be glorious. And I it still has not given me anything, which makes sense. It hasn't even been long enough for any of the chickens to grow up. It just hatched a lot of them. But once they do grow up, then the process should speed up considerably. And then we should be getting some murder happening all the time. Although, as Admin said, it might end up entity cramming the chicken, so I'm gonna have to watch that for a while to check if it does actually work. 
So I'll probably do a little bit of AFKing and then a lot of off-camera crying while I try to fix it if it does not work. But we're gonna hope that it works and that I won't need to off-camera cry. Well, on that lovely note- Okay, bye. Bye, admin. Bye. I, I wonder if that's them leaving so they can find me someone to raid or if that's just them leaving. Hoping it's the earlier one. However, we are approached the end of the stream, so I'd like to just go over what we have done today. Today, I started off by initiating me and the admin into the server, and now after six months of playing on the server, we are now officially part of the server, and the other two people who were playing on the server much, much earlier, they, they, just, they just never existed. They, they just never existed, guys. They just never existed. It's fine. It's fine. Never existed. But yes, we do now have proper initiation rituals so that when the new person does eventually join the server, we can do a full-on proper initiation ritual and see if we can scare them away before they even join! Let's go! But yes, after that, we decided to build a chicken incinerator because I wanted more feathers after trading with my villagers and deciding I need more feathers, even though... I have a giant stash of them that I completely forgot about. But yes, once again, I'd like to thank you all for watching today's stream. I hope you guys all have a great day, night, 3 a.m. pang attack, whatever this is for you. I hope you guys have a good one, and I hope to see you in my next stream! Wait, not English. Adam, this is the second time you've accidentally chosen someone who is- who doesn't speak- <laughs> whose stream isn't English. For the- for the raid. Admin. Admin. Why? Why? Man, I'm gonna wait for a couple seconds to see if Adam can find someone else to raid. And if if, if they can't find them, that that is a okay. You can you can raid a fire. If if you if you if you if you find a streamer that you like and won't have a raid block on, then go ahead. But do keep in mind that literally anybody who has more than like I don't know maybe 50ish viewers probably will have a raid block on, because otherwise they would probably just get raided all the time, which would be annoying. Okay, but yeah, since, since I'm stuck here for a little bit, I'm going to talk about the random boots I have here and the initiation ceremony. Hey! You found them! Oh, we've already raided them? That's great, that's great. We can, we can, we can do it again and they can be weirded out by who I am and why I've been doing it twice. Okay, well, let's, let's just set up that raid then, shall we? Let's just set that up real quick. And hoping I copy-pasted that whole thing. I guess we'll see you in a couple seconds! But yeah, I'm gonna send you all over there in about nine seconds. But yeah, once again, thank you all for watching today's stream. Okay, guys, I hope to see you guys all in my next stream. Ciao!